Mr. Reynolds, where are you employed? At the Giant Reynolds Motor Company. And were you working there on November 22nd, 1963? Yes, sir. How close is the used car lot which you work to the scene of the Tippett killing? One block. Were you there at about 1 o'clock on the 22nd? Yes, sir. And then what happened? What did you see? What did you hear? We were listening to the radio about the assassination, and we heard these shots, and we ran out on this porch, and we saw this gunman running up the street, and I followed him for a block until I lost him. And then I was going back to the used car lot, and this policeman stopped me and asked me what had happened. And I, I told him that I had seen this man with the gun, and I had followed him, and I lost him. So he took the description and my name and stuff like that. And while I was talking to him, some television camera was taking the pictures. And after that, I went on back to the used car lot. Were you questioned by agents of the Federal Bureau of Investigation or the United States Secret Service during November 1963? No, I sure wasn't. Were you questioned by FBI agents or Secret Service agents during December 1963? No, sir. Were you questioned by FBI agents or Secret Service agents during January 64? Yes, sir, I was. When was that, sir? That was on January the 21st. Two agents come out and they talked to me and asked me what I had seen. And I told them, and they showed me three pictures. You were questioned by agents of the FBI on January 21st, 64. Then what happened? Two days after that, as I was closing up the used car lot one night, uh, when I went downstairs to turn off the lights, some gunman was hidden down there and he shot me. He shot me through the glasses right here and the bullet lodged right over here. Mr. Reynolds, who knew about your questioning by the FBI between the time that you were actually questioned by them and the time that you were shot two days later? Just friends and, of course, my family. The commission concluded on page 663 of its report that it was wild speculation for anyone to think that there might have been a connection between the fact that you were shot in January and the fact that you observed the gunman flee from the tip of the scene. What is your comment, sir? Uh, if they would catch the man and prove that he, that he did do it, we could figure out from there whether he was connected or not. And until then, I don't believe anybody is smart enough to say whether, he, whether it is connection or not.